talk about video art in Korea, the person that most often comes to mind is Peng Nam Jun. But what many people don't know is that someone named Park Hyun Gi was actually Korea's first video artist. Well, he unfortunately passed away at a very early age, but his legacy lives on. His massive collection of over 20,000 works is still with us, and our Im Yoon takes us there. Where exactly does chaos meet order? The East meet the West. Korea's first video artist, Park Kyung Gi, explored where seemingly polar opposites clash, but also where they can coexist. Video art was a new artistic medium, not just for Park, but also for the world. And as for Park, media became just a tool. A tool for an artist bent on finding the place where traditions of Korea could harmonize with the new Western world, and where nature coincides with humanity. These artworks are on the foundation of nature, but also on Korean traditions. He wanted to find harmony with Western formal language in Korea. Things like rocks, trees and rivers, they can be found around the world anywhere you go. And naturally for Park, they became art that harmonizes with humanity. And nature immediately became his focus, necessary to begin a piece. He would have to go looking for his materials in the great outdoors. The rocks gathered from nature would lead Pak to his works, like this video stone tower, a work that would become key pieces to the development of his career, that project the same image as you would expect to see in nature. Pak blurs a line between reality and illusion in this low-tech, naturally unnatural work. But his inspiration from nature goes much deeper than the materials he used. Pak found a continuous cycle in life, and he conveyed that flow through his video art, each screen capturing another step in the circuit. He found this flowing connected system in the world and the cosmos, but also in his own two hands. For a park, one of the most important images is the hand. The hand has five fingers, but also holds the five senses, the five elements, and even the universe. The hand is close to you. It's something you use and see every day. So for park, this was a big part of his search to find harmony in our world. Park continually strove to think of ways of preserving the traditions of Korea, while still adapting to a rapidly Western and modern world. He was always looking for a unique angle of Korea. And as a result of his perseverance, he just may have found that perfect center. Im Yoon Hee, Arirang News.